Okay. It's time for the daily. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, ah. Uh, ah. Uh, 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 what is it? It's. Oh, okay. It's to the lamb. I've just been getting random technical issues this week. What is this? I want to learn what this is. Little portal. I don't know what this item does. Hey, Silver Dirt. Uh, things are good. Just wrapped up work. I did start a stream, but the audio went all weird on the capture card, so I had to reboot my computer. It seems to be fine now, but if there are any issues at any point, or it might sound weird, just let me know. Also, you use the opportunity to go put socks on because it's currently cold and my feet got cold. I still don't understand what this does. I thought this would be something that would grow as it kills enemies, but it doesn't appear so. Not sure if this is an issue, but the sound sometimes goes quiet and back to normal. Ah, uh, that's audio ducking. It reduces the game volume so then you can hear my voice clearly. It's intended. So then I can keep the game at a maximum volume when I'm not talking. what this is. What is this? Plume flute. A plum flute. Sorry, not plume flute. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. I like the sound it made. Oh, now it's bigger. I wasn't prepared for that. I didn't think that's what that item was going to do. Aw, oh, I won't get to use it for the boss fight. That's okay. Whoa, oh, oh, jeez, I almost died there. Um. Wait, I could only pick one? Oh, right. Ah, uh, yeah, they've, they've nerfed the loss. Because devil deals are free and they don't want you to have too much fun, so. You can only pick one now. 
Okay. That'll be useful in future shops, I'm sure. It is day two of me having a proper chair and it's been good. When I stand up and stretch throughout the day, I've noticed that it doesn't feel like I've been sitting down for ages like it used to. Just, I hate them so much. Go, friend, go. I mean, okay, it's cool, but it's a little distracting because I can't tell. Oh, he only does one attack and then goes away. Here's the issue with that item is like, it creates a bullet hell scenario, so if you're fighting a boss that is already a bullet hell, you can't really tell what's a friendly projectile and what isn't a friendly projectile. I don't know why I push those buttons. I wish I could get the BFF item, but I don't think I'll have the money. Well, maybe. Tiny Toma. Oh, I've had this before. The nice thing about this is I can just keep checking. You're currently playing Terraria and you're grinding for the Ancient Shadow Armor. I already got two pieces of it and you need the headgear and you're finished. The Ancient one, that's the, uh, that's the old school one, right? Like, the one that you can only get from drops. I kind of had an itch to play that game again at some point, but I think I'd, I'd have to wait for the next patch, which is soon, and one of the larger mods now has full support. For uh, the new patch. The stuff they're adding in the new patch seems to be cool. <laughs> I just love the whistle sound it makes, it's great. A plus, I don't know. Um, I think the movement speed's probably good to hang on to. 0.9 from Eater Souls. Yeah, I think I know which one you're talking about. Does it offer any benefits over the standard one that you're hunting for it, specifically?
Or is it just, uh, oh, it's a cool thing to have type deal. Which I, I, I can respect that. Like, a lot of the time when I play that game, I'll hunt down the trophy for the bosses before I move on. It's pretty much early shadow armor. Yeah, yeah. I just meant, like, is it... Does it offer a, a stat difference? Like, it's the shadow armor they had in earlier versions of the game. It's the one that I actually was used to when I first played it all those years ago and then didn't play it again until seven years later. Oh my god, that was quick. I love- I think it's a- it's a neat item, but it, it causes a huge liability. It just causes too much visual clutter. Pick up the gup. I mean... I'll still hang on to this because I think between floors it'll be okay. Uh, I've already gotten the item. Wait, what is this? Wait, okay. Wait, why are the items disappearing? Oh, he's eating the items. And then... That's a weird item. Ugh! No, I died. It spawned on top of me. Ugh. It's alright. I'm not having much luck with these dailies. I keep getting the lost or that... It's like the twins. I'm gonna call them the twins, but... The character that I'm not accustomed to yet. Because it's new and annoying to play. Alright, whatever. At least I learnt the purpose of a couple new items. Yeah, I wonder if those portals teleport you to a fixed location or if it takes you to some special room first. Because that's not worth it. it. Eating up random items just to give you a teleport. I don't know. It's a thing you can get before Eater of Worlds, making good against things until Skeletron. Right. I mean, I guess it depends what you're doing, because... Like, if you're a summoner, for example, I would argue you would want to get the Flink's Coat. And... Like, random stuff, and that can carry you. It'll be interesting to see what the game's like with the new melee changes they're doing. Okay, we consume both of these, so now... I get both of those effects. We get a free one-shot on Mom, which is nice. Oh, okay. That's, yeah, it's an XL floor. That's why I lost. It's okay.
flying in there. I'm going back one room for a sec. I need help. But yeah, I don't know. I might... I'll think about how I'm going to replay it. It'll either be that I'll play a mod. I don't know. Maybe I can do a multiplayer thing again. The one thing that I kind of regret a little is when I did the Expert Hardcore playthrough. I didn't save any VODs because I was listening to music and, you know, those two things don't mix. <laughs> but see, now I have a way to be able to listen to music and still keep original game audio. I'm just gonna complete this floor in its entirety because uh, I want to collect keys and bombs and everything and then I don't have to do it on the next floor. Alright. We good. I tried one last time to fix the Discord bot and it just, it just didn't work. So I give up. They've done something. It would be interesting to play the Burnt Star Seeds with Overhaul. Uh, mm. See, here's the thing. I think the I think the concept of Don't Starve is interesting, but. I'm horrible at any- any kind of scenario where there's a hunger system. I just don't do well. I constantly have to get reminded to eat. It just- to me, the hunger mechanic feels more of an annoyance than something that enhances gameplay. I know that's a hot take, but that's- that's my personal taste, I guess. I'll take the health, that's fine. If I was trying anything, I'd be doing... Because they're coming up with a new seed, apparently. So maybe that one will be interesting. But the mod I want to try is uh, Calamity, because that's one of the bigger ones, and it now has full 1.4 support. I mean, I'm sure some of the other ones are, are also getting there in terms of being ready. That's the one I know of. I remember playing Starbound and just constantly it was, Will, you have to eat. <laughs> Don't forget to eat. Imagine being reminded to eat. It was the same in The Sims as well. I built them a house, I didn't put a bathroom in there. 
or a shower or a toilet. I don't know. I guess when I play games, I... All those things... That you would do normally in real life, I guess I just... My brain turns off and it's like, I, I forget that they exist. <laughs> hey, Ona, thank you so much for the raid. How's it going? But yeah, I mean, I play games to escape that stuff. What is this? I forget what this does. Stats it is. We go stats. Yeah, I mean, I, I guess I'm not- I'm trying to say, I'm not saying I think they're bad games. It's just more anything that has hunger mechanics. Uh, it's not for me. Content, you're allergic to content. Oh no. I mean, in case of content, what do you have to take to make sure you're okay? should stick to angel rooms, I don't know. Maybe I need to see what items are on offer as a whole and then make up my mind about which is better. Doing fine, just being a potato. What characteristics of a potato? Also, this baby's great. I think the frozen effect is one of my favorite new effects. Just cause that. Yeah. <laughs> it's so good. I haven't really looked into the the seed, admittedly, in Terraria. But I guess just I I understand how I'm like with, with hunger. It's one of those things where I can imagine how it's gonna go down, like I'm probably gonna die to it more often than I should. I think you can access the boss that that seed gives anyway, so I think that's good enough for me. Didn't I try the Don't Starve one? I didn't, no, because when they released that, it hadn't been too long since I had finished the Expert Hardcore playthrough. So I was a little... I'm not gonna say burnt out, but tired, I guess. So I didn't really look into it, and it didn't seem like they added much else besides from that. No. 
Yeah, pretty much just that call up. Tears up, plus you feel forgiven. Oh, and I have angels now, so now... This actually does something. Crap. The hunger aspect was a pain. Fun with new bosses and items. Oh, okay. Yeah, I mean... I think that save would be something that I would have to play in a multiplayer regard. I feel like games that involve hunger, they're better played as a, as a group. Not because I think they're designed for groups, but because every now and then you, you're going to hear someone go, Oh yeah, I have to eat. Don't, well, they'll go, uh, hang on a sec, I'm eating. And then that'll remind you to eat. And that's... It's like, just making sure that you do what's required to survive. If I haven't played Don't Starve, what's the point? No reference. I played it twice, I believe. Maybe three times. And, yeah, I mean... It was, uh... It was cool, but the hunger was the problem. But with this patch, uh, it looks like they're adding quite a bunch of, uh, quality of life stuff. And again, the big mod that now has full support for that patch, and I've never played a, a big Terraria mod before. So that's what would bring me to it. But who knows when uh, when that'll be, right? Ah. Oh. Wait, that's still had a fly on it. I think that their latest thing they're trying to get done, they're trying to convince the Monster Hunter devs to allow them to put a Monster Hunter boss in Terraria. Well, not boss, but a monster. There's another crossover thing, so we'll see. You know one thing that I thought about that they haven't done, that I feel like they could do to make the game... I mean, not more interesting, but have, I guess, better replay value, like... So, The Binding of Isaac has a set number of bosses, but the way it keeps it fresh is, like, you have certain variants of bosses where they will do a slightly different attack pattern, or they might attack with something entirely different. You could very well do that for Terraria, is like, keep the boss, but then, like, have five variants of it. And you get a chance of getting, you know, a random one. Of course, mind you, that opens the window to, like, getting ones that can uh, mess you up more than others. But I think that's part of the charm of these kind of games, is sometimes you'll get lucky, and then sometimes the game does everything in its power to murder you. Yeah, I guess I'll get this. More keys, why not?
if I hurry, I might be able to make the boss rush timing. We'll see. It depends how the next floor goes. Oh, you know what? I probably should have just given that. I forgot. It's okay. Well, the bad news is I can't really see where I'm going. No, I see how much health I have, but I can see where I'm going. We just gotta hope that this map isn't annoying in terms of layout, and it lets me get the item and to the boss quickly. sign. Uh, that is damage reduction. I will take that. And more health. I'm going to skip this room because it's annoying. Okay, we got there in time. Got a whole minute. Uh, just bomb it. Nice. Good play. All right, now we're going here. Oh, but it doesn't consume at all. Uh, I guess targeted shot, maybe? Hey. Even if it only affects the first, it's still useful. Pretty decent at dishing out damage. Oh, yeah, right, I've got, yeah, I got cancelled the crap. I'm taking half damage, that's why.
I may as well collect all the free items. And the full heal too. Mm, not looking super healthy. What? <laughs> Didn't move. Is that a special rock? I can't tell. It is. Thought so. Um. Well, I would love that. That's a great item, but I can't... I don't know how to get in there. I never have quite figured that out. Ugh, stupid room! I mean, I'll, I'll consume it for a stat up, at least. What did I get? I got movement speed and luck. I mean, I got, I got time. I can make up my mind if I'm gonna go for a hush. I do. Didn't I get slow time in this? No, this was that was the previous run. I 
hate these yellow buffs. Thanks. I mean, this is a one shot anyway, so. I need to recharge this. Quite a bit of health. I feel like maybe I can do this. And if not, oh well, I tried my best. <laughs> okay, that that really puts a bit more confidence into this now. The only really annoying thing here... Yeah, I mean, I had to waste my charge. I can't tell how much health I have at any given point. I'm gonna have to go in with a leap of faith here. I'm not doing badly. I think I got this. Already halfway and he hasn't done any of the uh, the annoying bullet hell moves. I think I got this. Focus on 
why, why are the projectiles flying? <laughs> Easy. Ha! Huh, I mean. Alright, onwards. Oh, wow. I did better than I thought I did. Damn, I got a lot of marks on this one. And I got Mega Satan as well. Okay, let's see what they are. Okay, if we use, put it back, consume all of those. I'm gonna consume that, just not yet. It's still so dark. Oh, I've cast the darkness. I thought. I thought it was like one of those devil things that I killed.
I'm guessing here. Wow, it wasn't there. I thought that would be for certain, looking at everything that's around it. Flame tears. Whoa. <laughs> Why was it so big? Unless that's a different variant. Oh no, because of the, okay, the short range big tier. That's why it makes it gigantic. That makes sense. That's kind of ridiculous. easy. Okay, we're not done yet. No, come on, it has to be here. We're done now. Uh, let's just test here. Wasn't there. There's only one other spot it could be in. Okay, I give up. <laughs> and let's just hope we get to continue. I did this because then we get uh, heat seeking and flight, so we don't have to worry about ground effects. Yeah, that fire is uh, pretty strong. on. Let me continue. Yes. Cool. Maximum amount of marks I could have gotten in one run.
did I get hit by? I couldn't even see. Well, what is what is that thing? Oh, it's like, ugh, it's like that enemy, but with the split heart instead. Okay, please don't be good. Not useful. Consume it. Okay, I'm not gonna go through it just yet. I wanna get the six. I just want to make sure I have full charge. First, I'll just have to take the risk. Fuck. Okay, well, got no choice. Oh, okay, this is already almost over. wasn't much of a fight. Alright, cool. GG. Uh, I don't know why, but I was expecting it to be more tanky than that. And in one run, all that done. Um, so what's left? Mega Satan? Yeah. I feel like I could just now aim to finish this. <laughs> that was pretty lucky that I managed to get all that done in one run. <laughs> From nothing to a complete page, practically. I mean, I was debating whether or not to consume that, but I decided not to. Oh, okay. Fuck me, then. It does have its uses. Yeah, this, uh, this front's <laughs> not going well. Oh no. Spider. 
I almost met my end there again. Direct hit. Oh. oh, how did it not collide? Ah, that's damage, so I take it. Okay. I'm just thinking if I should mess with that just yet. Worth a shot. As the devil chance. Oh, and all these spiders. Uh, I feel like I have to go for the health here. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna buy this just so I can have it and not use it ever again. I don't have to buy it ever. It's not because I wanted it, it's just to register it. Oh, okay. How did it explode with the I can't remember if this item heals you when you pick it up. But let's say that it does. Yeah, okay, it did.
Uh, that's probably not a good idea to consume this. Leave it. It would appear that I'm never going to get an angel room or a devil deal on this run. Invasive friend. What does that mean? I have a spider in my face. So it's what, it's like a random quad shot? Free race of the enemy. I mean, I guess let's eat it. I only got it because it was cheap and I wasn't sure if I had bought it before. Maybe I should have consumed that. It seems to have caused me a couple of problems along the way already. Consume. That was a worthy consumption.
Um, I wonder if this old trick still works. Let me get... Oh, okay. Um, let me get this first. I want to get into... There we go. So I'm just going to leave it here. And the idea is eventually this item transforms into the better version of it. You know what? I'm going to use this as an opportunity to go to the bathroom quickly. Because it could take anywhere between like 30 seconds to a couple of minutes, so I'll leave this going. But yeah, it should transform eventually. I'm surprised it hasn't transformed yet. I I mean, I'm gonna do it because I want the item entry, so... Then I don't have to do this again next time. <laughs> Unless they patch this out, hold on. I'm gonna look this up just for sanity's sake. I'm pretty sure it still works. Imagine I'm wasting my time because they've changed it. may have changed this. Okay, so they don't transform anymore. They changed it. It's like the run will either have one or the other. I'm glad I looked it up. That's lame. It used to be on pickup 10% chance to convert it to the better version, but apparently that was too much fun, so now it's, well, the run... Under the hood will be like, it'll either be one or the other. Mr. McMuffin thought maybe it was too much fun. I'm not sure this rock is gonna go anywhere. I'm looking at the items I have. Oh, jeez. Well, what happened? Whoa, whoa, whoa. What the? Okay. So my head fell off, and there's a spider shooting. Okay, so that's what that item does. I mean, kind of cool. Go. 
on this thing. Yeah, I would say this this fly has fucked me over. Ah, dear. <laughs> it reduced quite a bit of my health. Just because the moment I would enter a room, it would hit an enemy pretty much instantly. These, I think, are worth getting. I like the icon for the bombs as well. on the first floor. <laughs> yeah, this is why I may have used all my luck on that previous run. Since I hadn't picked that up before, that's why I went for it, otherwise I would have consumed it. Sweep. I don't gain anything from getting the battery baby.
is why I didn't grab that hot piece. I wasn't confident I was going to keep it. Uh, there we go. Worth it. I got the range up anyway, and some movement speed. <laughs> it's cute and shocked. Yeah, I think that's probably the cutest boss in the game, I think, now. Battery Bob. Is a shame. Uh, I hate these flies. Go away. Not even sure consuming that's even worth it. You dicks. Open these two up. Should be doing this here. That's, that's why. Full health. There's a second full health pill here, so. One set up, one step down. I can't say I've ever seen one of these in here. Does this do anything? No. Okay. I thought maybe they may have changed it to do something. take advantage of this while I can. Uh, 
the mothers. Alright, well now I have to go back. The blue map is superfluous, like it's... I already got the Splunker hat, I'll know where the rooms are. I suppose the blue map would tell me where they are up front, whereas in... I think Splunker only works if you're near it. Oh, okay. More money! so quick. This, uh, this pill that reduced my fire rate is gonna hurt me something severe. I think Let's just speed it up, one bomb. I'll take that hit. I'm also gonna take it. Consume. Take it just because we don't have the charge anyway. Can't open these, big sad. Okay, that'll do. I was kind of hoping it would give me another key out of that. Unless that second chest has something amazingly good in it. Okay. 
so I, I have all this money. But I don't have a key to get in there. Thanks. It's not like I was trying to head in that direction. Absorbing that means I can eat trinkets whenever. Alright, cool. I'll take this as well so I have the option available. Oh, and this too. This could be very good if I can keep getting trinkets, I'll just absorb them. a lot on these devil deals working for me. Oh. Oh, right. He transformed. I was like, I got two of them? Spawn directly on top of me. That should not be allowed. Didn't even give me any time to react to it either. It's just nope, instant damage. Too bad. Why why do you stand there for? Shouldn't have been standing there. It's your own fault. Be having a problem with keys. Oh, there we go. Took the risk, it was worth it. 
I got more damage out of it. That's one of those, like, every second shot does more damage type scenarios. to do that it's time to move on to mario so we'll leave isaac for here i'll continue whatever this run is next time uh i need to stretch my legs for a few minutes before that so give me like five or so minutes and start up janked up mario party but if you're here for isaac thanks for watching